I'm in here. Oh, what was it that I wanted to say? <clears throat> you know, I don't know if I spoke about people putting battery acid in things, facial sprays. If you're having beef with someone and you know they're just they're just getting a little too dark, yeah. Facial sprays, mouthwash. But someone up their game, I guess they couldn't get their hands on any, to scraping off what's on the outside of your battery and putting it in pepper and shit. Be careful of that. And then here. Yeah, I was gonna say, let's give a shout out to the sexy geeks. You don't get enough credit. You're my favorite kind. Women and men, the sexy, beautiful, smart women and beautiful, smart men. <clears throat> yep, this one's for you. I feel so connected to you. Those of you, Derek, those of you who are in relationships and you're both that way, it feels isolating, sexual, or maybe it needs to be. <laughs> okay. So there are a lot of you that are together, it looks like. Married. This feels like a good marriage. Yeah. Now, there could be two of you that have platforms. That's what it looks like to me. One could be building, or you do it together. Scorpio, possibly. Oh, uh, what's going on? Are they trying to destroy your platform? Are you kidding me? So she's a criminal. If they're, they could be doing some type of death ritual on you too, that won't work. Constantly doing attacking people that have that have social media content that building anything. What what kind of world do you want to live in? This, the, are these cults doing black magic? And this could even be hacking. It doesn't feel like that though. It feels like I'm angry that you have a platform and you have a skill. And I don't. That's it. You don't want to learn anything. You, there's nothing that you could actually teach anybody. This is all you got. Right. Gemini, Leo, Scorpio. This is what makes them happy. I mean, I guess. Be careful of that shit coming back, though. You don't know enough about energy, goddammit, when you do this shit. You do know that when you send something out to somebody who is a really good person, that shit doesn't stick, right? It's, look at it like this. I want to throw gum on a bowling ball and hope that it sticks. And then you would represent the bowling ball with a wig on it. You're filthy like that, which is why the shit doesn't work. I don't understand. Anybody that has a successful YouTube channel or a successful platform, this shit is going right back, right? Especially if whatever message they put out is helping people in any kind of way. If, if you get any kind of attention, well, they should be leaving mine alone because they shadow banned the shit out of mine. They shouldn't even be attacking mine anymore. I don't feel like they got anything out of it except for death. Especially if you have a platform and you know what it's like now and, and you're struggling or you, you rely on your revenue from that shit and you're in turn doing black magic and other people. Just fell. Claire. Something's about to flip. Yep. Your shit's going to get shadow banned. I'm not sure how it's going to happen. It's going to have to... Either be employees wind up getting fired, and then they're going to be real careful about who they're hiring. 
this shit with working for YouTube from home, I don't know how that can be conducive at all. It doesn't seem like it is. I didn't get my pay yet. I don't know if anybody else did. There could be something happening here with this too, or they could have been doing some type of, were they hacked? And they're not saying anything? <laughs> Maya? High Priestess. This feels like a secret cult group. Hackers. Plenty of fish. You would think there's plenty of money to go around, there's plenty of everything to go around, and you get these people who feel like they're entitled to the shit and someone else is supposed to have nothing. Let me get some letters. Castlevania. Castlevania. That's it? Okay. Oh, they know. Got it. Uh, HN. Yep, these are constant warnings. Is correct. HNPI. Are you feeling some shit in your hips? There's a lot of, okay, when you start feeling burning in your hips, that's your sacral. Uh, sexual shit, it could definitely be that you have some type of group excessively masturbating to you. Good times, good times indeed. Let me see what else is. And it also could be, I wake up sometimes with my hips hurting and I know it's that, but I also feel, I believe, that there's a possibility that because of what I feel physically while I'm sleeping that they're trying to mess with the cartilage in my hips through laser anybody else wake up now with their hips hurting they've been doing this for a while even trying to they're experimenting on us to see what they can do with laser surgery remotely you need consent you can't just start operating on motherfuckers like this, you know, I'm performing abortions and next thing you know, they're going to be, children are going to be born. You're going to wake up and your kid's going to be sitting at the end of the bed, <laughs> feeding himself or he's already going to be on your nipple. And speaking of nipples, what do we do about the nipple thing? This is what I believe it is. I think it's multiple things inside logic, yeah. Nanos, the shit that I showed on my video the other day. They always show me joysticks. I don't think all of them are playing a video game. I think now a lot of people are getting involved in this. Some people are telling kids to play and they're waiting until people go to sleep so that they don't, you know, nobody will say, yo, it's actually a person that you're playing and we feel this on our body physically. Maybe now some of the kids hear me. <clears throat> but. It's that in the mix of the heavy metals in the chemtrails. It could be just natural. Do men have the same thing as women there? Like neuroreceptors or some type of sensitivity shit? I don't know. All I know is that if the, if the goal end game thing is to, is to cause chaos, and you think that you're gonna sit back and be exempt from from any kind of repercussions from that chaos? You are wrong. <coughs> and uh, let's find out what's gonna happen first. Let's get the hip. Be careful with somebody putting catnip in the weed. Maybe I'll borrow your daughter. Nope. If somebody uses that term and says, can I borrow your daughter? Say no. They use this term often, but this next time, they were building trust with you this whole time. Every time they borrowed her, they brought her back. It was to build false trust. The state of being in the known. Yeah, but it's also known as the hip bone in the pelvis. I'm telling you, I know you guys can feel the shit. I feel it too. 
I think that's all that they want, want me to talk. What's going to happen to those who are messing with nipples? Toe? Tugging on your toe? In virtual reality, you did. Anybody want to... Anybody want to chime in and try and stop the shit before you wind up waking up and there's a, a murderer standing at the end of your bed in virtual reality and they can actually touch you and kill you through that? I've already accomplished some things. I haven't, I'm not on any kind of platform. I don't do virtual reality. I'm, I don't even have an Instagram or Twitter or anything like that, but I don't, if anybody thought that I was, I don't know if somebody made some account saying it's me. I've never, ever even put virtual reality, whatever these things are on. I've never tried one on nothing. I have no desire for that shit. I need to say that out loud. So we're messing with, there's the nipples, you know, hey, mess with the nipples and you're trying to block this shit, right? I mean, what did we do before? I said, when you put cotton there, and then they go and they up their game for something like that. And then I actually was thinking of putting Gorilla Tape on my titties the other night. I was, and then, you know, I, I love my boobs. I, I'm, I'm in love with my boobs. They're real. They're still where they're supposed to be, and I just don't want to do it to them. Uh, so that's out. Um, there has to be something, right? They need space. It feels like you have hands, robotic hands, yes? It's all laser. You see that the lines that can go up, down, and cross the red. You with me? You see them like that? That's how they're doing it. So they have to get into your shirt, into your bra. And what do you do? Put a scuba suit on? Somebody's going to do that. And at least try it out. Tell me about what? <laughs> the only other option is to figure out what element blocks laser. Yep. You have to constantly be detoxing the heavy metals from your system. There's something with the metal and something else connecting. Fiber optics being put. It looked like fiber optics is what the nanos looked like in my video yesterday. They're made of glass and plastic. We're filled with toxins. Yes, yeah, some solid, some liquid, some gas. Shit's ridiculous. Um, Maureen, my, I'm tugging on my left ear. Whoever you're around right now. <clears throat> with the descend popping up, I feel like the ancestors are saying, or otherworldly beings will say, that didn't realize that this world was going to descend like this this planet they don't even know what to do I want to say that I have faith that people will just say this isn't right and the only way to get people to stop doing anything is to have it happen to them right I know some people killed themselves last night because they started feeling it uh, some of them were good and others were the ones doing it and they started feeling it but the, when you're addicted to doing this or you're just that person that says you can't tell me and you do it anyway and you're feeling it I mean you, that, that's just a whole other level of going insane it, the whole the goal is to drive create insanity on the whole planet memes this says Piper and Pete, Pete. huh Nathaniel? It's not Hannah. Is that right? Okay. Close pins. I thought about that. That's what they're putting on them too? Alligator needle nose shit, all that shit. Hooking them up to batteries. What happened to you as children that you wound up doing some shit like this? I'm going to put names out there and that these groups that are out there handling shit. I'm gonna help you out. Give me some names, please.
Orlando. FN. S E. Okay, Neo. Is that someone's nickname? Is that happening to? Oh God. No, 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 no. Is it? I gotta pause. I'm gonna find some shit out. Please don't tell me that you're gonna try and do that. They're the the. This is what they want. How about this? Is this crazy? Creating a video game that they can view from the sky somehow? They're gonna start lighting everybody up. Neon is a guess. Is that what you're gonna try and do now? They're showing me a view from above and then wanting to turn the entire planet into a video game. You have to be kidding me. The only way that I know to stop this and know that it's going to stop is to just say out loud because that when I say things, they happen. Every person that is involved with this, everyone that's even thinking about getting involved with this, death. That's it. There is nothing else. You're way past any kind of yeah rehabilitation at this point. Especially when you're doing it to children. Not that it's okay and better to do it to adults. But, oh my God, I can't stand it. Who, who even came up with this? I won't give it to you. Who, who came up with this? Who was, who was the first person to, to come up with this? Or one of the first people to, to do that, please. Is someone's name Georgia? E M. H N. Are the Nathaniels? We've seen an episode where the voice sounds like the voice of the man, but it's really a woman. Is this Emmett? And then what you do is, right? <coughs> you grab them, you just scoop them up off the street. Not that I gotta tell you guys what to do, but, and then, you know, you just interrogate in your own special way. <laughs> Let's get another message. Other than that, you know what made me feel better? Terminating the nanos, deactivating the implants from Dr. Virg Virtual. I mean, playing it loud. Don't read the description box, no disrespect, but this is how it helped me as well as listening to Heavy Metal Detox. Now I get my laptop and I open up a tab for each one. I can listen to multiple at one time. I download them first, so I don't have to be on the internet. <clears throat> and I'll put Heavy Metal Detox on, uh, Detox on one, and you can alter the volume actually in the video for each one, and, right? And then I do the nanobots for the other, and then the implant deactivator on another tab and then the neutralizing, Arcturian neutralizing energetic implants. It actually calms them down because whatever they're doing with magnets and lasers, it's agitating energetic implants that we have inside of us. This is what I did the other night and it was all right, but as soon as, as, soon as you eat food, the nanos are in there and whatever they're putting into the terrain is in your food and your drink and everything that's being made and the air that you breathe. And this is why we may have to wind up not using air conditioning and heat that comes in and blows air in from outside or, or air that can be blown in. You may have to get uh, an electric heater. This is just shit that's going to have to happen, you know, and, until all these people are gone and they will be gone. If the whole world has to drop, if every, because they're going to, there's even situations where people are being blackmailed and told to do it. This blackmail shit has to stop. Anybody who's blackmailing anyone, death. You guys are disgusting and I can't stand the shit. And, and I really do believe that this is why majority of the world is gonna wind up going. You're gonna either be too attached to your, your material shit 
And this may even be karma for some of you guys that you're supposed to have some of your shit go bye-bye because of the way that you got it. Okay, some of you forget how you acquired some shit. They don't forget. So, because a lot of you can't say no to money and some of it's counterfeit, you're being given counterfeit money looks very good these days. You're going to have to, your morals are going to have to come into play at some point. And, and it's going to require you to take a loss in some way. Don't sell your soul over some shit like that. I'm going to end it there.